Yo, how's it going? Today we're playing Baphomet. We're playing like the realistic Goathead. And this character is super fun. He has a dash, as you can see. It recharges every time you flash. And it looks super cool. I guess the red areas on the right is what makes it like that. It's a fun character. It's very strong. I've tried this ability on bosses. Trust me, it does a lot of damage. I can probably play the whole run based on this item, like without doing anything else, without shooting. Maybe because it starts with 2.25 damage. So I assume you're not supposed to use it that much, to shoot that much. This aside, the dash also avoids fires and stuff. It's just so brokenly good and so funny as a gimmick. This is one of those characters I can say I really love the concept of. This is worth playing. Also, I've lately been having some issues with Isaac. I have one save file that does not allow me to start the game anymore. As in, if I start a run, it's just gonna go on a black screen. So I help me decide what to do with that. Should I reset the file and do my fifth dead god? Or should I find, try and find a solution to that? If I do get to reset the file, then I'm probably gonna stream it back. I'm gonna do it in stream and or chocolate milk? This is good. This could, Can I dash while charging, I wonder? Yes, I can. So yeah, let me know. Let me know if you want me to restart the file and bring it in live, because I'm definitely down for that. That said, the first boss is going to be a headless horseman. Okay, look at the damage. See that? That is the damage of a goat. Like, literally the goat, the best character. Me in here. Half HP has been stripped from this guy. Now it's only one more dash, I assume. Let's see. Yep, and we even get a contact damage item. This is nice. I wonder if we can rig this into a contact damage only build. What is this button for me? Oh, it flies. That's unfortunate, but not a problem. It's just such a funny gimmick, and it just works so well. The timing is maybe a bit fast, so you can use it very fast consecutively. Let's see if I can blow this guy up. Yeah, oh, but I couldn't blow the rocks. And don't even have keys for the treasure room. This is going to be a big of a problem. Try to group up all the flies. Yeah, you have to group up enemies. If you do that, you're in the clear. The fact that I love is that this is a brand new mod. I've just found it on the Steam Workshop. And yet this character looks super complete. It is wonderful. You can dash sideways. I didn't try that before. Okay, that's one more thing I discovered. But yeah, it looks so finished. And I even spawn flies. Oh no, I'm spawning flies. Time to see our treasure room. Mom's wig. Oh, okay, I didn't shoot tears so much. So this is actually counterproductive. But it's alright. I wonder, does the dash last longer if I hold it instead of press it? It doesn't, but you can change momentum. So that's good. No soul hearts at the time though. So that means that one hit is all it takes for my devil to go away. Now, where is the most contact damage based items? Is it devil or is it angel? Because that I really don't know. I know for a fact that Angel has a couple and I've just gotten hit and what happened to me? Why am I okay? This is a very interesting transformation. I'm gonna keep it, get into the boss fight. This is Monstro, all right. See how much damage I deal. Okay, see, that's a problem. It's sometimes stop right before the enemy and then when I end up walking into the enemy, I get damaged. Outside of that, I, I think that's like the skill factor of this character. In that case, it works really, really, really well. Monstro is dead. Absolutely nothing I could have done against us. We get the screw. This is the time to choose. I went Angel last time, and I have enough HP this time. Let's see what I have in here. And more of the void. Okay, so I have HP and more of the void. That is interesting. I feel like I will take both, but I'm gonna take more of the void alone. I think it's gonna be the right choice, and I've just wasted a key without my consent. There was no transition in there. It was literally just the boss fight and getting me in there by mistake. I've seen it happen a couple of times with this game. I probably need to drop my trinket because it's messing me up. Hold on. Get out of here, man. I don't want you. Ruining my runs for what? Why did that stop me? Yo, 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 wait, 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 wait. Scary, scary. I still need a key for that treasure room, though. There's a couple in here. Pretty sure I could probably reach them. I mean, I, I got a key from the drop. There's probably secret on top, too. I'm rhyming my stuff. What do I have? Large zit. No, I'll take random. Smart fly. Okay. See, we're getting the contact damage build. So far, it's going great. Bomb over here. Secret room. No. Well, stuff like this also happens. It's unavoidable. But nothing that's going to stop us from clearing these rooms like nothing. I should be able to dash through most of this. Yep, correct. I even have the mirror dimension here. That's a free item. I might take it, I might take it, we'll see. I've literally taken half HP off of this boss simply by dashing into it. I don't want to damage it too much because I don't want it to, to go underground. My spiders did the job for me, sadly. Come on, man, come out of the wall. There it is. That might be a problem. I cannot attack you, get out of there. There we go, done. Dead so easily. I get an HP up and a devil deal. Absolutely. And the Krampus, hey boy. Oh, look how interesting. The fires are not even working. 
and he's been one shot. Okay, plus Lamp of Coal. Very, very good. I got two clubs as well. More bombs. I'll take it. Now, enter the mirror dimension of this boss. Let's see. One shot was enough to get him at a quarter HP and straight into his face. All right. She'll be out of there pretty soon, though. His faith is imminent. Nothing he can do. As soon as he comes out, I'll dash onto him. There we go. Dead. See what item I get? Blood Claws. No, but I didn't get anything that good into the mirror dimension. But, well, I did get the store credit, which I can spend once. This said, I'm curious. I want to see if I can dash and get this for free. I can. Okay. That's 100% worth it then. What do I have in here? Soul hearts and spiders. Good. Worth investment. I mean, not even an investment. It's literally just free stuff. And maybe a reason to check the shop because now I have both 15 pennies and something free like the blue map. If only I had spin down dice. Wait. Maybe, maybe this is the rig time. This is where secret is. 100%. Be the spin down. Be the spin down. It's a chest. Seconds away from greatness and it has been ruined for me, but I'll take the bloom up anyway. It's not bad. All right, all righty. It's time to go to the next floor. Get into catacombs. We have something special in here. Did we get keys back? I got keys back and damn, how many HPs do I have? Wow, that's way more than I expected. Enemies I cannot dash are my worst enemy right now. Not a kind I like, but it's surely not thing we're gonna find so much of. If I could group these guys up and then dash into them like that, I got hit somewhere. I don't know where, but I did get hit. This is an interesting room. Hold on, I want to do that. Bye, Larry. Didn't mean to, but you were a casualty. What do I have in here? Book of... Why do I have... Is it a choice? I'll take Book of Verde. This is not a choice. One is just a, a baby? Why? Well, okay. I'll, I'll blow up the beggar as well, even. Why not? Use this for an extra wisp. Oh, now this goes with my active. I mean, it's not even an active, the one I have. It's just my ability. It's okay. I used one of the keys. What about the other one? It's a D4. or oh, I am so tempted. I'm gonna do the whole floor, and then at the end, I'm gonna go and D4 that. My run is good. It's not bad. I shouldn't complain. Even when I'm shooting tears, I'm very strong. But I want to see the potential. What if I get a devil? Also, why is my angel chance higher? Wait, what? My angel chance is higher than my devil? But I went devil. Oh, because Book of Virtues. Wow, this is a good run save. See, guys, however much you may go and want to go devil, the angels will always find you and salvage your run. That's just how it is. I don't have any keys for shopper treasure now, though. That might be a bit of a problem. Just a tiny bit. This is the treasure. I got a key straight away. Wow. And these I'm not going to reroll. This is going to be like key for us. And I wonder, does the D4 reroll our active as well? I mean, the one that lets us dash. Because if that's the case, that might be a no-go. But I have to risk it. If I don't risk it, I will never know. This room has been done. Now it's time for the boss. This is not going to be mum, is it? No. It's the Dark Ones instead. Okay. Is, does this mean that this gives me a devil item, potentially? Should be. Well, only one way to find out, right? Against him and see how it goes. Ouch, I've been hit. Man, what a pain you are. Haha, <laughs> get dashed against. Toothpicks? Lovely item. Oh, I shouldn't have done that because I wouldn't re-roll. My specialist music is not working, but holy mantle. Oh, wow. Yes, let me do this. Let me even place another bot. How? How did I get damaged? Okay, I should probably take the holy mantle, you know? Probably will serve me good. Let me dash a bit. Dashing should be making this a lot easier. Come on. There we go. He's dead. Get the key piece. I've wasted too many HP on this. And I'm even going to lose my mantle because I, I just didn't think about it. All right. Back into the door room. But do I do it? Let's go. What do I get over here? Okay. I shoot super slow. I did keep my... No. Okay. My holy mantle is gone. But I do have a lot of strength for my tears. I don't know why. I mean, I know why, but I'm not sure I like it. That's the thing. Because I had a good build centered even around the good items. The orbital items. I know I do have one left still, which I should go back into taking. And oh god, it did reroll that item. Well, I couldn't find a way to re-enable it. So now it's a default run with this, that I assume. It's nothing bad because we got Epiphora. Come on. Cannot complain. I mean, I can complain because this is not really that good. Nor equivalent. But maybe we can still rig this. We can still break the run. How come every time I showcase a modded character, it goes up ending in me not having anything? And what is my active? I think that might be a modded item from one of the other mods I installed. There are a couple of mods I'm planning on bringing, but that's gonna be for another video. I'm not gonna spoil anything yet, but I'm sure it'll be a fun, fun time because they're very well made, just as this one. Okay, something happened. So the inner ability of this character is still there. Get into the secret room, see what we have. Oh, rock bottom, my beloved. Wait, 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 wait. With a P for us, does this mean that I can... Hold on, hold on, please tell me it works and tell me how fast it's gonna get. I hope it's gonna get pretty fast. It is getting decently fast. This is good for like 10 damage. Is this it? I think this is it. Okay, now I have this. Well, 
Rock bottom saving my run, question mark? It only takes a few hits, so now we become a tears-based character instead of a dash-based character. That's an interesting involvement, but I'll take it. Ouch. And when this happens, I get 20 damage? For what? I guess this is the, like the ability of the character and thing. Where's mom's hand? Okay, there's one. Where's the other one? Two? Okay, that's all. That's all. I've lost the blue map, sadly. Nothing I can do to get it back. I have a 33% chance of devil deal. I have a 9% chance of devil deal. Never mind. So yeah, some things explode. I have that active. What does it do? It says race black maker dev tool. So what happens if I... Nothing happens if I use it. Interesting. I have enough pennies to buy something from the shop. The compass might be interesting. I'm taking damage and it's like, I don't get why. Oh, I got glass shot. Okay, okay. I understand now. Well, let's go on then. Let's just demolish these bosses. Wow, look at the damage I deal. That is a, that reaches me down there. Really, really does. Well, okay then. I'll take it, whatever. I've even gotten a tears up, so that means that if I do this, I should be able to get faster at some point. I just have to hold for enough time, and there we go. I got it faster by 0.80. Do I have spectral? I even have spectral. Yeah, I do. Wow. Well, that is working wonders at this point. Run has been saved, guys. There is no problem. Wait, this is not where treasure room is? What a weird floor. Why do I always have to have treasure room so far away from the boss? Also, if you're enjoying this video, do not forget to like and subscribe, because that really helps the channel and you'll get the notifications for the next one I upload. So let's get it going towards the 2,000 subs. But now all I have to do is clear this room if I were to be able to. There is one soul heart. I'd like to get it after. And now all I want is that treasure room. I want it to be good. I want it to be something nice. Infestation 2, yes. Infestation 2 is super nice. Like, this should be quality 4. It used to be the best item, or I mean, amongst the best item in rebirth. I even to, like, considering it next to Brimstone. Now it's kind of quality free in between, and I don't know why, I still see it as super good potential. It spawns spiders when you kill enemies, and when you kill enemies you get super broken. No bad thing about this. I still have this active that I don't understand what it does. But okay, I'll just use it every now and then. Uh, looks cool, it does look cool, I'll tell you that. Don't even know if it's from the Baphomet mode or not. There is uh, the full card I can take. Am I in time for boss rush? I am in time. There are red keepies? Really? I might get lucky. I'm gonna use it to find the ultra secret, maybe. Let's go. Hi, mum. I, I need to make this in time and check the deal as well. This might be a bit complicated, but it's not a worry for us. Yep, that that's more than good. Take the damage up, get in here. Anything good? That's two out of three can draw in. Oh no, one out of three, because I lost something. What about the boss rush though? I am uh, pogging. Am I pogging? What, is that a pog? I guess it is. There is no quality for that. There is no quality free. Hey, yeah. Let me get that cute baby. That's two out of three conjoined. That was a very good choice, I have to say. Very, very good. Now we have two babies. Super solid. I'll take the red key. I do not have bets on where the old truck will be. So I might just as well do it next floor instead. Next floor. Oh, but here I have the special rooms to guide me. Yeah, now I'll go for the special room guidance. I'll I'll just use it here, see if we get anything. No. Well, we tried. We got extra enemies, which means extra spiders. I also got to see what's in the shop. Take the soul heart. Take options, because this is the last shop anyway. Let's go. Now, room is going to be easy as hell. If I want to go harsh, maybe I should save my key pennies. But I don't know if we're going there. That's the thing. This should be secret. Come on, stop moving my bombs away. Let's say it's not secret. I, I don't know. I don't trust it. I'm definitely not going to go in the mini boss room. Okay, this might be secret. What is going on? Why am I getting taking so much damage? Stop. I don't want to keep them bleeding. Okay, well, golden poop. At least this gets us some money back. Money equal power will be interesting right now. That could break us some more. With rock bottom, everything becomes good, really. That's the thing. But I only have one key? Damn, I didn't notice that. That's a big problem. I'll have to sort it one way or another. That's a super tinted rock, which gives me a chest with a lot of stuff, but again, no keys. Damn it, and I even wasted one to open it. That's the thing. I really need to open here. If I have no keys, that's gonna be a big problem. Come on, beautiful spiders, do your job. There is one key. I'll take it. I'll use it for one of the treasure rooms. My priority in the hash floor is always treasure room, treasure room shop, and then the chest. Like, if I have time or if I have spare keys, I'll go for the chest. Otherwise, I'm not gonna do it. This is another tears up, which means I could abuse it even more. There it goes. Now we're getting stronger. Is that the maximum? That is the maximum. Let's get up. At least we have tons of HP. This one we can be sure about. I'm gonna... I was saying I'm gonna get the keys. Uh, I just walked into the bomb instead. Oh, okay. We still have one treasure room we can get. There is a key, but that's a chest. I wouldn't know. I'm, I'm gonna play it safe. As they say, better safer than sorry. There is another key. I cannot get that, though. 
I would think this is a potential secret. Let's have a look. It is. Do you have anything good for me? Even more money. That's technically more money. Not exactly, though. We also have a potential crane game in here because there is an arcade. I'm eager to explore that and see if I am right. If there is one, I might spend all the things in there and keep the other key for the treasure room. Or for an eventual chest, there is a crane game with Guppy Scholar. That can be a thing. Okay, and first try. What is the second item? 9 volt. Not a fan of that item, but okay, maybe we get lucky. No, 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 no. We did not get lucky at all, whatsoever. Well, it is what it is. I'm surprised we got it first try with a Guppy Scholar and didn't get anything else. See, now, now I took the chest and it was way worth it. This is a boss item. I might just as well force myself in there through the secret room. Let's go. Place a bump here. Walk in. It's right rage. Speed up. Yes. Anyway, we deal tons of damage to any single boss, so it's not going to be a problem. Oh, you, Mama Gertie, how horrible. But what a bad death he suffered of. We come out just where we've left before. Back in here. This should be dead in nothing. I've taken damage. A very stupid damage, but it's okay. Hi, Mum. How long do you last? Those two are probably gonna destroy all of my spiders if I'm not attend. Mum is dealing some good damage to me for some reason. And that's just my pure skill issue. That's the reason why. What do I have in here? Death side. Yes, absolutely. Give me the damage up. Where is it? Oh, I think I need to get damaged again for the damage up. Oh, okay. I, I can get damaged again. We got this. No worries. Do we have item? Okay, there, there is the damage up. Now we have 28 damage and conjoined. Conjoined with no tears down. Oh, wow. Yes, yes, yes. This is working just as intended. What do I get here? Mum's wig. Contagion. Yeah, I'm gonna get Mum's wig here. Much better item. I don't have much, so I'll just explore some chest. One and two. Got unlucky. But not a problem. I'll just try and get a crawl space now. Any crawl space anywhere? Not in this room at least. Nope. What about the other one? Yeah, the other one had one. If this is going to be a black market, I'm going to go insane. It is not. Okay, but it's charming tears. And that's mother transformation? Even this. Okay, this is the transformation guy. How lucky are we to get all of them? Now it's just time for hush. Sadly, no key out of there. But let's see how much damage we deal. And oh wow, my screen is immersed in tears. I should probably like try and find a way to stand still. As much as possible, at least so that I can abuse the double tier baby. Look at this. It's just insane the amount of tears that go through him. And the fact that I cannot see the enemy ones. Mine are too big. It's been hard to understand where I am. But right now, I'm in a good spot, I feel. Almost at half HP. This guy is having a rough, rough time. And look at his flies. They just die before coming out. Oh, even the enemies. Okay, that's just free spiders for me. Keep on spawning. I feel like I'm safe in here. I should be safe. I am. Wow. This is just perfection. This is just going as well as it could go. Yeah, spawn more stuff. Oh, that, that was kind of scary. They got a bit too close to me. He's almost on to the last phase. He's on the last phase. That is it. That's it. I should be safe in here. Okay, safe in here. That's that's That should be the last thing. Oh no, he's shooting another side. That might be a problem. I might be in a hit zone here. He's dead. He's dead before he could do anything at all. And we're not even that broken. Let's go. Now, into normal rooms, this should be more than broken. There is a home mini bed, like baby bender. That means that my... Do my tears coming from the double baby count as this? Because if they do, then it's a bit broken. That means my tears have homing when they go through him. And a lot of tears go through him. Let's see. Uh, it doesn't look like it, but it's alright. We demolished this monster. This monster literally disappeared before our eyes. Uh, wow, so did this. Get me the sack. Maybe I get another key. Ace of hearts. Convert soul. Uh, no, 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 no. This is not as good as the other one. I need to be very patient in here. There we go. Room is done. Let me go back and take this, because this is much better. I will assume that this one at bottom is secret. If my bombs would actually stick on where they belong. No, it's not. Maybe top? Please be some of this. It's not any of this. Oh, come on. That looked probable, though. I was pretty sure it was going to be. Okay. Do I get a soul heart out of there? No. I get temperance instead of something else that I didn't even see, I'll be honest. And Satan. I'm just going to stay here and spam, even when he transforms. There we go. There is one. There is two. There is three. And now there's going to be the fourth. Let's see. Okay, yeah, I had to move a little tiny bit, but that was enough. Last phase with the legs, this should be absolutely no problem whatsoever. Only two stumps for him, and back in the chest. Dark room may have lots of stuff in for us. Wait, we rerolled the key? Where's the key pieces? I've taken the key pieces. I'm being scammed over here. Well, okay, I guess we're not doing Mega Satan. That's a bit sad. There is the Voodoo Cross. I'll take this for the free Holy Mantle. Do I need it? Absolutely not. But do I want it? Eh, why not? All I wish for now is a lot, a lot of chests because that could change our run in a very different way. Tears up. This is a massive tears up. I should be able to shoot even faster. Hold on, hold on. Let me P4. Let me abuse my AP4 in here. Come on, 6.12. 6, 660. Okay, that's a good change. That's a massive change even. Shady, die. Okay, he's dead before he could do anything. 
Thank god, I hate that enemy with a passion. If you had to ask me for the worst enemy in this game, he would be there. In Rebirth, it would have been another one. In Rebirth, it would have been the blue version of the fatty. But now it's him, and now there's the lamb. Lamb is not even able to do anything. He didn't shoot once. We didn't get a delirium portal. Well, I guess I'll run there here then. It's been a pleasure, guys. GG's. Hey yo, I hope you enjoyed the video. If that's the case, consider to like and subscribe, and I wish you all the best.